Hi everyone, it's Annette from Acrylic Art Alchemy in Australia. Tonight I'm doing a 30 centimetre round canvas and I'll be doing um, a bloom swipe. Um, for those of you who wish to do the bloom course, there is a 15% discount that you can get and you can just um, look down in the description box and grab that. Uh, but I'll tell you exactly what I'm using tonight. First of all is British Paints Low Sheen House Paint in white and one is slightly thicker than the other, it's just how it came in the cans. So I'm put the thicker one towards the middle and the thinner one on around that. Hopefully the thinner one will act as a flow aid to move the paint over to the sides when I'm spinning. Um, I'm, all my paints and pigments tonight are mixed with Taubman's Neutral in Gloss mixed with Joe Sonia gloss varnish at a ratio of three paint to one Joe Sonia and then you either use a bit of the um, Torbman's on its own to thicken or a bit of Joe Sonia water, uh, um, mixed with water to thin um, uh, pigments of course has to be dispersed first in some Joe Sonia varnish and then the Paul Melia Madden First I'm laying down Jo Sonia Brilliant Violet, it's a tube paint. Next is Artisu Sapphire Pigment and I'm putting that sort of next to the purple but overlapping it a little bit. Now I'm adding TLP ball gown or this little pigment or this little piggy it gets called and it's an interference gold and that's down through the centre of both the purple and the blue. Next is a lime green by Liquitex which is a tube paint. It's a beautiful green colour. And on top of that, I'm just squiggling along some Matisse acrylic ink in Southern Ocean Blue, which is a gorgeous deep turquoisey colour. And then I'll be adding what we call the cell activator. And this is Amsterdam Titanium White um, mixed with Australian Flow Troll to the right consistency. Usually three to four uh, Flow Troll to one paint is enough. And I'll be putting it on the back of this tool, um, this palette knife tool, uh, and, and turning that back around so the paint, uh, the cell activator is face down, and then just swiping across. Just doing it in a bit of a squiggly pattern trying to skim across the surface rather than go too deep. Right, from here on I'm just going to tilt and spin, maybe add a bit more paint to the outside, so I'll put this on fast forward.